much. You know, we've talked a little bit about Atlantic City and our, our summers that we spent there. In 2011, a couple of interesting things happened that I think it's fair to say were beyond our control. One was there was a hurricane that came off the East Coast, and so we actually had to cancel two shows. It's like the only two shows we've ever had to cancel. And of course, for those of you that were in the Northeast at that time, it turned out to be like a heavy rain. You know, we were in New York City and like kind of walking around outside, I think while the hurricane was there. So that was a little bit silly. The really fun, maybe fun's not the word for all of us, the really unusual thing that happened was there was an earthquake in the summer of 2011. Yeah, earthquakes! Woo! Woo! Tectonic shifts! Um, wow, I was really dumb science guy back then. Um, and it was interesting, it was in the middle of the afternoon, but we were all in Atlantic City. I know I actually was, uh, a, a few of us were actually out playing golf, and I don't think we noticed it. I know, like, like Dave, DR, where were you with an earthquake back then? I was, uh, first of all, factually incorrect. We did cancel the show because of, uh, we got snowed in in Iowa once. My bad. My but, bad. Okay. other than that, he wasn't in the group then, so we didn't know. Uh, let's see, I was in the office uh, in AC, and I was doing sort of the business stuff, and it felt, yeah, boo, dude. And uh, I felt like, it felt like you were driving in a car and wind hits the car, and it kind of like moves, and I was like, oh, it's really windy outside. Wait a minute, I'm not in a car. <laughs> What should I do? <laughs> He's often think, very uh, drunk while he does our uh, business. Stuff, so. <laughs> that explains a lot. That explains a lot. I think Jerome and Mike were like in, in one of the restaurants and yep. uh, Courtney Schmicks. Things were swinging and well, so we were uh, we were out playing golf and the only really the only way we knew there was an earthquake was we got this amazing text message from Randy. <laughs> he group messaged all of us, all caps. I don't know, like fifty exclamation points. <laughs> Run! <laughs> the text message is not really that useful because by the time you look at your phone, you're like, oh man, I should have looked at this five minutes ago. I guess I'll just stay where I am. Except that one of us apparently did get the uh, did get that text message. Tyler, after you got that text message, what, uh, what did you do when the earthquake hit? Well, uh, first of all, I'd like to point out that we don't get earthquakes in Iowa. <laughs> so I read a text that says earthquake, period, caps, get out now. <laughs> So I ran down 27 flights of stairs, and I was halfway to Borgata in about 30 seconds. And I texted everyone back, and nobody else was out there. It was just me and some casino dealer. Was just one other guy. Everybody else yeah. is going about their business like a normal. I made great time though, so yeah. I'm ready in case you know. Yeah, it's, uh, I don't. Might have aggravated his ACL at that point. I, don't know. I, I saw a lot of people running. running, so I started running with him. So <laughs> so <laughs> Free money to Borgata! <laughs> I know that happened. Um, so, uh, terrible segue. Speaking of <laughs> acts of nature. Two, one, two, three, go! <laughs> when you feel down and out, sing a song and make you a You just can't. Now, baby, sing a song. It'll make you wait. Sing a song. 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 S
Watching.